Hello everyone. So, hi Thursday. I have been promising you guys more vlogs with my family pets in them. And this is actually our cat Thursday. Come here Thursday, come here. And Thursday is actually a rescue kitty, which is come over here. Yeah, who's a handsome boy? He's a rescue kitty, probably a part uh, Maine Coon or Norwegian Forest Cat. He's very gorgeous. He's got the face, the profile, definitely mixed, especially because if you look at his little tail, it's so small for something that might be from a Maine Coon family. Where are you going, Thursday? Where are you going? Come here, yeah. But yeah, Thursday is the cat that lives here at my parents' house. And I was actually there. I went with my mom on a four-hour long drive because Thursday's rescue story is that we saw him on Craigslist. My mom was looking at Craigslist and she saw this beautiful orange tabby who looked kind of a little rough around the edges. And it turns out that he was going to be put down the very next day. And he was going to be put down in a animal shelter that was four hours, four hours Thursday, one way, four hours away from where we lived. And so, come here boy, yeah. And so we ended up driving out there and we adopted him on the spot. We brought him home, we gave him a flea bath of the century, and he proved to be an extremely shy, very, very nervous little cat. He was chased around, he didn't live with anybody, they caught him and some of his siblings out of a field in pretty much the middle of nowhere, Missouri, so there wasn't really a lot going on. Who knows if he was with people or if we, he was a little stray cat before, but as you can see, he's super duper friendly, and when we first got him, he was this friendly, he's never been aggressive or violent, but he's always been super duper shy and timid. And he kind of reminds me of learning to work with your very shy and timid friends. Sometimes things are a little overwhelming for them. And sometimes he just wants to go and hide in the closet. He spends most of his time. In fact, it's been about five or six days of this visit. Yeah, five or six days of this whole visit before I could even get him. Where are you going? Before I could even get him to come over and spend time with me because he was so nervous about seeing me again. So he reminds me of those friends that we might have who are really shy and it's hard to get them to like come out of their little places where they feel safe. But they're so kind and they just got a good heart and they're so friendly. Oh, he's my good boy. They're so friendly and loving once you can get them comfortable and on their own terms. And I've always remembered that about him. Yeah. He's very shy, but he's one of the sweetest, kindest cats that I've ever known. And we've known a lot of cats in this family. But yeah, so look at his little ear hair. Isn't it so cute the way it curls around? So he's always been one of our... Oh, and you can hear him purring. Are you purring for the camera? Are you purring for everybody to let him know how wonderful a rescue kitty can be in your life? Yeah. So he is one of our rescue kitties, and he's the only kitty that currently lives here at home with my parents now. And he is very well, very well loved. Oh, you got your little, gotta clean your fur, yeah. You want, you want me to get the little brush? Yeah. But yeah, oh, there we go, there we go, all the love, all the love. Oh, he's a good boy. Even, he's not a kitty that will do things on demand. He's shy, you've got to kind of work with him. But we've all got friends like that. Yeah, we've all got friends like that, don't we, Thursday? So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, and I hope you guys have enjoyed meeting Thursday. And remember, you can go rescue a little kitty, and he might just turn out to be a really awesome best friend, huh? Yeah. Thursday, <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Oh, you licking me? You licking me? You are so cute. You know how cute you are? You are so cute. That's how cute you are. So cute.